Hey guys! Today we're going to talk about the nitty gritty of the waterfront parks in Long Island City, Queens. Let's get started. Welcome to Jackie and Sasha, the New York City elopement team, where we give you tips, post videos, and chat about all things wedding here in the Big Apple. If you are new to our channel, make sure to click the subscribe button and hit the bell icon to get notified when we post new videos. You can also find us on Facebook and Instagram at Jackie and Sasha. The waterfront parks are located on the west side of Queens, right along the East River in the neighborhood of Long Island City, or as we call it, LIC. As a reference point, it's directly across the East River at 42nd Street in Manhattan. The waterfront is actually made up of two separate parks, but they're placed right next to each other. The north end is called Gantry Plaza State Park, and the southern part is the Hunters Point South Park, although you'll never know it when you walk from one park and into the next. Ultimately, none of this will matter when you see the breathtaking views of the New York City skyline as the backdrop of your wedding photos. It's super easy to get to the LIC waterfront parks via subway, cab, or ferry. If taking the subway, we suggest the 7 train to the Vernon Jackson stop. It's the first stop out of the city and just minutes away from the Times Square or Grand Central Terminal. The E, G, and M subway stops are close as well, but with a little extra walking. If you prefer a cab, my favorite suggestion for your wedding day, you just need to cross the Queensboro Bridge or pass the Midtown Tunnel and you're pretty much there. Or you can take the East River Ferry and enjoy the great views on your way. Both parks have a ferry stop. Lots of options. The Queens Waterfront is still somewhat of an insider tip, our own hidden gem. During the week it's still pretty quiet and you can find lots of nooks and crannies for your ceremony. On the weekends it's a different story. It can get pretty busy over here, especially in the warmer months. Let us know what you envision and we're happy to help you with the timeline that works for this location. It truly is beautiful here. Here's the nitty gritty on whether you need a permit or not. The Gantry Park is a state park, therefore in theory, you have to apply for a permit. Hunters Point South, on the other hand, is a city park and requires no permit if you have less than 20 people attending your wedding. So talk to us and we can give you some more details and tips regarding this process. But remember, the parks are directly next to each other. You can literally walk on the other side of a park bench and you are no longer required to have a permit. Let us know how we can help make sense of this. The Queen's waterfront definitely shines during good weather. In fact, there really aren't any covered areas in the parks that can shelter you from bad weather on your wedding day. We love these parks. Gantry Plaza State Park and Hunters Point South Park. And the views of the city are spectacular. The parks are easily accessible and in an area of the city that very few visitors know about. A few blocks off the park, you'll find some industrial areas with cobblestone streets and graffiti and beautiful wall art. It is great for a different type of photo in your wedding album. Although there are two things you want to keep in mind when planning your wedding. The weekends get really busy here in LIC. So think about a weekday ceremony. And there's bad weather. It can definitely be a challenge with the very few covered areas in either park.
So that wraps it up. The nitty gritty of the waterfront parks in Long Island City, Queens. As always, don't hesitate to reach out with any questions that might come up. We're always happy to help. Until next time. Do you have a question about what we've covered in this video? Or maybe you have a suggestion on a topic we should tackle next. Leave us a comment below and we'll get on it. Click on the subscribe button to our channel and check out some of our other videos with helpful tips and tricks when tying the knot in New York City.